Hey, what's going on guys? It's Cody here. Uh, you guys asked the questions and I'm here to answer them. Uh, so without further ado, also, if I mess up any names, I am really sorry. I'm also going to try keeping some of these questions pretty short because I have a lot of questions to go through. Wyatt asks, what is your favorite animal? It could be a myth monster too. Hmm. Well, I love Jack Link's beef jerky. <sighs> Probably Sasquatch. Here you go, fella. <gasps> try this one. Now, if it was a real animal, um, it used to be a zebra growing up, and I have no idea why I like zebras. Wait, 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 stop. You're eating my cousin Jerry. Austin asks, what is your favorite song to play live? And now, this is a difficult question because, um, there, I just love a lot of the songs that we have, um, I love songs to get the crowd going, and those three for me would probably be the Sea of Storm, Chaotica, and Wrath of a Gentleman. Those currently are probably my top three. But there's also a lot of new stuff that is unreleased that is is going to be up there. So uh, I can't wait for you guys to be able to hear that stuff. Raina asks, most embarrassing story or awkward moment? Um, I probably have a million, but two of that stand out on the top of my head are uh, when my band, The Wise Men's Fear, we were playing... A uh, house show. Um, it was like a Halloween concert. It was like a Halloween thing in this dude's basement, but there was the place was packed, like wall to wall. And um, I was I was you know doing my thing. I was jamming out. And um, there was somebody amp somebody put their amp like right in front of my amp, and so my cable from my guitar like went over that amp and like snapped. And all I heard was like, like a loud Ehh! and uh, it went on for like ten seconds. And uh, somebody from the crowd like had to find me a quarter inch, and they handed it to me. A quarter inch is a, a cable, um, and they had to hand it to me while while this loud, annoying noise is going on because my amp was cranked. And uh, oh man, that was so awkward. Also, um, another thing happened at a different show where almost the same thing happened. I went to go do a spin with my guitar, and um, my my input jack popped out of the amp. And so the same thing happened where it's like a loud, eh, and we were playing in like a, like a venue where like, um, it was like a lot of older people who probably weren't like into the kind of music, but we were asked to play. And so we did. And so, um, they, they were just all sitting there like, what is this guy doing? <laughs> Next question comes from Marcos, and that is, what's the best thing about going on tour? And um, my answer for this is probably seeing new things and uh, meeting new people and meeting all of you guys, of course. Next question comes from Zuri. Do you have a favorite band? Um, this question is one of those impossible questions to ask because I, if somebody has a favorite band, it's probably going to change. Um, I have plenty of top favorite bands, um, but... Um, that changes a lot. What I can do is tell you uh, what I've been listening to lately. If you haven't heard of any of these people, you should definitely check them out. Uh, the first band is called Outrun the Sunlight. They have amazing instrumentals. Uh, Angel Vivaldi. I, I, got, I got to meet him a while back. My band actually got to open up for him um, at a show in Indy. Um, he's an amazing guy. He's, he's super awesome. Um, you should check him out. And one of the, probably the heavier bands I've, li I've been listening to is... Uh, Fear and Wonder. Um, I love, I love a lot of the uh, effects, and I just love the breakdowns. Uh, check them out as well. Jake asks, if you were a girl, would you be into guys, or would you go straight lesbo? Lesbo, would you be the butch or the girly girl? What the fuck? This is a hard question. Well, I'm not into guys, so it'd be girls for sure. But I'm no butch or ass captain, so how about neither? Okay. The butch. No one's in control of me. Next question comes from Eric. Uh, when are you going to play at a Houston, Texas show? And uh, this is a good question because 
Um, we actually just got off two tours. Uh, I've been wanting to play a Texas show forever. Currently, right now, we don't have any tours uh, set in stone or anything. We probably won't be playing another one for uh, a little while because right now we're currently in the studio recording our next album, um, which I'm excited for you guys to hear that. We just got off tour with In Dying Arms and It Lies Within, and uh, we also had a kind of a DIY tour before that. Um, but yeah, Texas isn't a place we've played yet, but would love to. Isaiah asks, what bands influenced you? This is another tough question because um, I, I don't choose specific bands from a period of time. Um, this goes from all over my lifetime, uh, starting with like, when I was growing up, my dad would listen to a lot of Linkin Park, Rob Zombie, stuff like that. And then uh, slowly um, it got into like Prada and then um, both my Valentine. And then from there, um, you know, back in the day, I even listened to Limp Bizkit. Um, so it just, it comes from a span of a lot of stuff. A Day to Remember, Parkway Drive, just a lot of bands. Kiera, Kiera asks, tacos or burritos? This is a serious question, and that it is a serious question. I haven't been able to give a straight answer for a lot of these questions because, because it's impossible, man. Um, okay, so if you go to Taco Bell, they have this thing called the Frito Burrito on the dollar menu. is like one of my f favorite if not my favorite thing on their menu um, but I love homemade tacos just as much so I can't answer this question Nick asks when did you start playing guitar um, I started playing guitar around 2005 uh, so that was about 10 11 years ago um, my dad got me a guitar for Christmas because I pretty much begged and they did um, and they didn't know I was left-handed because I okay one of the questions I get asked a lot is uh, why do you play your guitar backwards? And I'm gonna answer this question is uh, ties in with this. My dad kind of just spaced that I was left-handed and he got me a right-handed guitar and um, pretty much I let it sit in the corner of my room for like months. So, like I finally convinced myself that I really 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 wanted to play it and so um, I pretty much it, it wasn't easy because I had to read all the tabs flip upside down and I, upside down. I, I still do. Um, but, um, I just learned that way and I've been playing it that way ever since. Jake asks, what is your favorite Bring Me The Horizon song from the new album, That's The Spirit, if you have a favorite? Actually, um, I haven't even listened to the new record yet. Um, I haven't been into Bring Me The Horizon for a while. Um, basically I really like their first album that they ever put out, but ever since then they've just changed their sound and it's... It's just something I haven't been really into. Justin asks, am I your friend? Well, of course, buddy, you're my friend. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sorry if I mispronounce this name. Uh, Ry Rylens asks, do you remember me? If you do, what did I ask for help on? Um, I'm not going to lie. Uh, I, I talked to a lot of people. Um, but... When I, when I looked it up, you I remember you asked me uh, to help you with some song lyrics, which I did my best. Uh, glad to hear from you, and I hope you're doing well. Caesar asks, Megadeth or Metallica? Um, probably Metallica, because I just like the fast tempos of their songs, and um, I like the riffs and stuff like that. Juan asks, do you like Filthy Frank? I love Filthy Frank. Hey, boss. Which this ties in with the next question. Uh, Caesar asks, do you like H3H3? Um, I haven't really watched too much of H3H3, but um, I've seen what he's done with iDubs and his uh, real food testing or whatever, where, where he'll like go and test different kind of foods. Uh, it's, it's, it's funny, so you guys should definitely check that out. Jacqueline, sorry if I'm not that wrong, asks, do you like 21 Pilots? And I really like 21 Pilots. I know a lot of people are aren't into them, maybe find them annoying because they get played on the radio all the time, but um, I really I really like their music. Samantha asks, favorite Halloween candy? Um, the ones without razor blades. Just kidding, I love Reese's. Miranda asks, how did you get into music? How long have you loved it? Like since childhood. Um, I've always loved music. Um, I remember being in like being like in like second grade and my teacher, he, he would play music in the background while we uh, took tests and uh, did work. 
and uh, one of the bands he was uh, playing was called Sting, and uh, I even told him I really, really liked the music, and he went out, he went home, and uh, he burned me a CD of Sting. I think he burned me a CD of Sting, I can't, I can't remember. Amy asks, what made you decide to form the band, and where did your love for music start? Again, uh, a pro probably a few of these answers are going to be uh, repeated in this, um, because they all tie together. Um, a combination of what I had said about the uh, Sting, my teacher, when I was little, um, played that, and it, it got me into that. And then uh, my dad, he would play music in the car all the time, on drives and such. Robert asks, how old are you? I am 22, and my birthday is on December 20th, 1993. This year I'm going to be turning 23. Dakota asks, favorite game console? And I can't answer this question. I love the Xbox 360, I love the Nintendo 64, I love the PS2, I love the PS1, um, I love the Xbox One, I love the Game Boy. Um, basically it all ties down to what games, because a lot of those are nostalgic for me, and um, I grew up playing a whole bunch of those. Uh, consoles and um, yeah Ryan asks are you vegan no I am not I love tacos I love Chinese food um, I love pizza there's just so many good foods I would like to be vegan because what happens to all those animals is quite unfortunate I've never tried any of the uh, alternative meats yet so maybe if I try those uh, things can change but um, until then, I, I just love so many foods that require meats. Don't hate me. Finca asks, You like Bring Me the Horizon, Sleeping with Simon's Crown the Empire, or Asking Alexandria? What's your favorite song? Um, I'm not really into Bring Me the Horizon. Um, maybe that can change. I need to listen to them more. Sleeping with Sirens, I actually met Kellen Quinn um, uh, years ago. Um, their I, I like their music. Uh, Crown the Empire. I really like Crown the Empire and Asking Alexandria. Um, I love Asking Alexandria. Uh, that's kind of what got me into what I play now is just from all the stuff back in the day. And a lot of the people who say that they don't like any of those bands now um, are probably lying. I'm, I'm guaranteed that they used to listen to those bands growing up, at least at some point. Sorry for pronouncing your name wrong. Uh, Roniel asks, uh, do you like electronic music? Um, I love electronic music. I, uh, I love Skrillex, Dubajani, um, I love, uh, what's your name? I love Afixa. I actually, I used to, um, I used to make electronic music. I still do from time to time. anything like for me to put out but I do want to start getting back into it and um, doing it again because I enjoy doing it Oscar asks would you eat a Havana chili if I knew what that was I would eat it hey guys thanks for watching this this is gonna be the end of this episode um, I have a few more coming to answer the rest of the questions um, this video honestly took a lot longer to edit uh, than I thought it would. Um, it's been taking me a few days and like hours of editing, so it's actually really uh, late here, so I gotta kind of keep it down. But um, if your question wasn't answered in this video, I am very sorry, and uh, don't feel bad, I'll get it in the next video. But uh, if you like this video, uh, feel free to leave a like, uh, subscribe for more, and I uh, appreciate it, and uh, see ya.